for that beautiful song and brother Maurice White for those beautiful lyrics. Anyway, you guys, I came on here. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, family. Whatever side of the diaspora that you may be on, let me welcome you to the mental house um, in this uh, world today. There's no telling. Anyway, I'm your host. You get it. Khadija. And in this crazy world, it's <laughs> every day it's something crazy. And it's multiple crazies and multiple crazy things. So today I want to share with you a story about a place that I was thinking about relocating to uh, until I really, really got interested in the Gambia. Uh, and that is uh, Belize, because I had a friend of mine who had a sister that uh, was in Belize, and she made it. She just told us a lot about the South American, um, what a Caribbean island of Belize, of Belize, and um, it was it was a it was it's full of beauty, okay, tropical, all the beautiful aesthetic and. Uh, environment you could ask for. But today we're talking about an American daughter-in-law, a British billionaire, and she's said to be charged in connection with the death of a Belize cop who was fatally shot during a massage and after they had been drinking. Now what the hell really going on? Okay, Jasmine Hartson, the daughter-in-law, I mean daughter-in-law, of British billionaire Lord Michael Ashcroft is said to be charged over the death of Belize Superintendent Henry Jamont, according to the slain cop's family. Jamont, 42, was found dead in the water off San Pedro Island with a gunshot wound to his head early Friday. And prior to his death, he had been drinking with wealthy Martin, Hartin, an American socialite. Hartin told detectives she was given the officer a massage moments before the freak accident, according to the local reports. Um, Harton is being held at the jail, and which local describes as hell on earth. So, this is insane. This is a British billionaire who was charged with shooting the black police officer after they'd been drinking and massaging on one another. The two were drinking and socializing on the pier before dad of five, Jamont, was killed by a bullet which hit him in behind his right ear, allegedly fired by his own service revolt. Harton told the detectives that she was giving the officer a massage moments before the freak accident. And according to the local reports, the pair had reportedly been playing around with the weapon before the shooting. The officer's sister, Marie Jamont Tools, told Daily Mail Sunday night that the blonde socialite was about to be charged and would make her first corporate appearance within days. She said, I got a call, but they did not say what she was going to be charged with, said Marie, 55. An unconfirmed report on Belize television suggested that the glamorous Hartson will be charged with manslaughter after she told investigators that Glock, the Glock pistol went off accidentally as she handed it to Jamont. 
the police police department could not be reached for the discussion. Now, she has two children, and here she is in this thing, and she's pictured with Andrew Ashcroft at a ribbon-cutting ceremony for their new resort on May 7th. The police are trying to understand how Henry Jamont, a black guy, ended up dead, shot with his own police service revolver in a single hole piercing the skin behind his right ear. American Jasmine was drinking with Jamont before she died and was pictured handling a gun at a shooting range in an image local news outlet said was taken for her Facebook page um, supposedly nine years ago. In this picture, she's you know, showing off her assault weapon. An officer was who was among the first on the scene suggested that Jamont fell onto Harton after he was shot and he fell into the water when she pushed him off. Marie, a retired social worker, told Daily Mail, I haven't seen the news because I'm so overwhelmed and devastated by my brother's death. I can't speculate over whether they will bail her out or whether she will stay in prison because I don't know the charge yet. What I would say to Jasmine is give closure to our family. Tell us what happened. We want to know for the benefit of our family. He was my only brother. Good luck with that. He had five children and a partner 14 years. Every time I look at my nieces and my nephews, I break down and cry. Please tell us what happened. Jamon's family had previously rubbish suggesting that the officer took his own life despite claims he was experiencing marital problems. Sister Cherry Jamont, an assistant superintendent with police police, told Daily Mail that my brother would never kill himself. He had plans for his life. In September he was to be promoted to senior superintendent and he and he was and he was to be transferred to another unit. My brother was a very top cop with a big dream. She also added he had a gunshot wound behind his ear like an assassination. He is so skillful after twenty four years as an as an officer he would never have left his guard down. He was a top cop. I don't know how he let his guard down to be shot with his own gun. Cherry said a security guard heard a single shot. Cherry says she believes her brother, whose nickname was King because he was his parents' only son, and Harton knew each other because she does business in San Pedro, and he was the officer in charge of the area two to three years ago. Insane. Insane. Meanwhile, Henry Jamont's niece, Renisha Martinez, wrote on Facebook, I know for a fact that my uncle would never do a suicide. He was murdered, and we need to find justice. That man loved his job so much that he wouldn't even take days off. It really does smell, smell of foul play. This blonde model type chick goes to the Caribbean to get her sex party on um, away from her husband who was Andrew Ashcroft of the uh, renowned Ashcroft family, who she shares two children with. She had to work her way back to the police chief or a sergeant, whoever he is, the police chief, and now he's dead. Uh, Y'all think she did that? On purpose, or do y'all think that it was an accident? Leave your comments below because I really want to know what y'all think about this. She's sitting up here posing with all these rifles and weapons. <laughs> okay, if you like what you hear, please like, subscribe, and share.
please like, subscribe, and share because these algorithms are not being nice to me. And the only way I can get past that is, is from a little help from y'all. I mean, straight up. A little help from my friends. Okay? So please leave your comment below. And uh, I will definitely, definitely see you guys in the next video. Thanks.